Mr. Smith, hello. How are you doing? Always great to see you. Aloha, we're in Hawaii. Aloha, yeah, yeah. aloha. <laughs> <laughs> you can't possibly go around we're saying that. Oh, no, really. It's very enjoyable. It's a romantic mm. comedy. Mm. The initial reaction of women is, oh, I love it. Mm. It's <laughs> Ooh. Mm -hmm. But was the humor the most important factor for you in a story like that? You know, it was. We, we know. We, we knew going in that the romantic comedy is ten. Generally, you know, two guys aren't going to have a beer and their buddy they, they go to see a romantic comedy. But what essentially what we created was a comedy romance. I mean, this this movie is a full on comedy, and right. you know, it it is hilarious. And uh, and I think it it, it's, it might be one of the funniest films. That that I've ever made, you know. It's you know I got to look. Men in the first Men in Black is kind of funny, um, but you know I, I just think that that um, that I think the film appeals to everybody because of the the approach to the subject matter, the the comedic approach to love and relationships, and not not the not the full on mushy uh, approach. It's true, there's nothing mushy, and what I enjoyed mm. most of all is that, you know, usually it caters to women, you know, mm -hmm. everybody uh, sees the sentimental side of women, and mm -hmm. here you get in deep with the sentimental side of guys, Absolutely. and that must have been something that you've enjoyed as well, right? Yeah, what, what, what was great for me with, with uh, creating this film, the, the idea that I think we, we've never really seen um, in recent history, we've never seen a really aggressive male lead in a romantic comedy you know the like uh i was looking at the the uh the uh philadelphia story with uh with uh carrie grant um and um there in the, the opening scene carrie grant was uh carrie grant uh was, was audrey uh, Catherine netburn i think and he grabs her face uh, she hit, She breaks his golf club, and he he grabs her face and shoves her and knocks her down in the opening scene. And I was like, "Wow, you know." So Cary Grant was really the model that could be that aggressive and still women uh, you know, love him and were attracted to him and all of that. So I was trying to get that, that get my my little Cary Grant on. Of course, well, you have it. <laughs> is that something you believe in? That you know, you see a person and you feel the she's it factor. Mm. Uh, absolutely. I think that I think that that everybody has had that feeling that you know, men and women, you look at someone and it's like, wow, I don't know what it is, but that person is the one, you know. And it goes beyond physical. You know, you always look. You know, if somebody has, you know, a lovely body, of course, you, you know, they could be the one <laughs> <laughs> for the night. They, you you are the one for the night, girl. You know. But I think that pe we know when we feel something. A, li a little more and it's like th I think that love is the 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 ultimate human theme you know Absolutely. it's like that's a, what we all search for well my last question is you know with any good comedy it's very important who surrounds you in terms of acting. Absolutely. and in this you know it was very carefully eclectically chosen Absolutely. It? yeah it, it's um with, with the with with these films you know and again making it making these films in uh, America you always have to be you know, somewhat, you don't have to be, but you know, if you, you know, spend that much of the studio's money, you know, you need to be sensitive to, to, uh, to racial issues, you know. So, you know, for me, I wanna, the, the melting pot that is America, or the, the, the melting pot that, that uh, America claims to be, you know, it's really important to me to be able to display that in a functional way in, in uh, the films that I create.